viewer discretion is advised. Hello everyone and welcome back to LSPDFR here in an unmarked Ford Crown Victoria. We will be playing as a sheriff department. Um, it should be pretty good day or night, I guess you could say. It's like sunset, even though it's extremely bright out for sunset. <clears throat> but this is a beautiful car. What the fuck was that? Um, very minimal light structure um, and stuff like that, so it's nice and it blends in here. We'll be working at a Sandy Shores and Grapeseed area. That is a beautiful shot right there. I absolutely love Crown Vicks when they have the... Uh, Hubcaps, those look like some, some beefy ass tires too. Holy shit, those are some beefy ass beef, blah, 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 blah. beefy ass tires. But anyways, we're gonna get this started. Just wanna remind you guys if at any point I make you guys laugh or you just enjoy the video in general, please hit that like button. It always helps me out and it brings new people to the family. I love you guys for doing it for every other episode so far, getting over a thousand likes. It truly means the world to me. We're gonna get this started though. We'll go ahead and get out here on patrol. Uh, I believe we're on duty and everything. Actually, we're not on duty. Isn't that just sad? This is like the 30th time that I'll get in here, and I'm just so damn excited to play with you guys that I just... I Oh, looks like I already was ready to go. Um, but unfortunately, didn't get that far. Now we're good to go. So, as we usually will do, or as we usually do, I'm going to run throughout um, Sandy Shores. Just give it a once-over. Make sure everyone's... Um, is that a cop? I wasn't sure if that was a cop or not. I'm going to go ahead and turn around just to see what's going on uh, with this bike. I don't know if it was a cop, and he wasn't in a uniform, and already he's gone. How the hell did he go that fast already? Oh, almost hit that guy. Um, that was weird. I, I swear he was on a cop bike, but he did not have a cop uniform on. Uh, that started enough strange, though. Hopefully we'll see that guy again. I'm going to go ahead and just go down to this end. Uh, I'm gonna pull over really quick what I found for I'm not sure if anyone else does LSPDFR But really quick if you go to vehicle options and then go to the second page on the right side It says engine power multiplier and you can change the multiplier of the engine so you can make this go faster I just wanted to throw it out there to people who play this game and maybe sometimes feel restricted um, When driving uh, like a Crown Vic even with a custom handling line in there watch so I'm gonna just gun it and you'll see that we can go so much faster than what we usually would normally be able to go which gives us the ability to really catch up um to any bad guys if we have to do that so let's go ahead and really knuckle down on this patrol i'm going to get some calls going it's like we actually have a terrorist attack in grapeseed we'll go ahead and uh, get onto that looks like it's going to be a code three armed with explosives at this time so we'll really be able to put this engine multiplier to use when you can see how we're already up to 100 miles per hour right now. So that definitely goes to show that if you really want a little bit of extra horsepower, this is what you want to use. I didn't even know it was in there till today. Okay, shots fired, shots fired. I'm a flipping a bitch. I'm going to have to turn this way. We're going to have to make our way up. Hopefully... <clears throat> okay, I got 30 fucking bullets. Are you kidding me? Get on the ground, you motherfucker. This isn't gonna... Oh, shit, that scared me. Got other officers on scene from the LVMPD. Oh, got that guy. He's getting shot like a motherfucker. I'm gonna go to pistol, because I have not that good of aim. Okay. Damn, it sounds like a fucking war over here. Off More officers showing up on scene. This is amazing. I don't know. I feel like my shootouts are always just amazing. I love them. Oh, that guy's still up. Okay, watch out for uh, civilians. I'm reloading. Shit, he's running at me. Oh, I got him on the, got him in the chest. Not down. I don't think my bullets are hitting him from this far. Gonna keep trying to get this one. There's a ton of guys left. Oh, he's just getting drilled with bullets. Oh my god, I'm going to have to switch to first person because this aiming is just not working. 
This bitch needs to get out of here. I need to stop doing James Bond rolls through the streets. Shit. It keeps switching the civilian. Dude, it is going down over here. I don't understand what's going on. Uh, right now, it's even it's even linking on my own officers. What in the hell? This is a crazy patrol. This is some fucking war zone shit. Even this guy got out of the gun. What is going? I gotta get some fucking health. This is not working. I gotta go into my trunk, which holds some type of health, and just cap myself out because it's going down. <laughs> I don't know why he holds a gun like that all of a sudden. We got people shooting from that aren't even involved in this anymore. Looks like we got one over here. Okay, I gotta move in with a shotgun or something. This guy. Okay, it's clearing up. This guy's still alive, but I don't know where the officers went. I think I might have to move down there. And, uh, okay, looks like he's actually down. I'm gonna just clear, because holy shit, that was insane. I have so many bullet holes in the back of my car. Damn. I... <laughs> Let's rate that shootout. How crazy of a shootout on 1 to 10. 10 being the craziest, 1 being straight, just the most ditziest thing ever with two bullets. I think we capped it out on, uh, 2016's biggest shootout in this game. Holy fuck. I'm just going to go and collect this money because it's rough times right now. The economy's kind of fucked up, so. All right, we're going to go ahead and get out of here. 124, I uh, made it through the gunfight like I rack in this bitch. And I will be code 4108, developer for calls, heading back to uh, Sandy Shores. Right now we have a Grand Theft Auto that just took place not too far from our location. I'm going to go ahead and get code 3 uh, to try to get caught up with the suspect right now. Looks like we're going to have to take this dirt path over here. They are cooking right now, and they are on the dirt. I have no idea what the description of the vehicle is. <laughs> you would think that that would be pertinent information in a stolen vehicle case, but uh, as of right now, we're kind of just chasing after a vehicle that we know is stolen. We have um, helicopter units that have just been dispatched out to the location, but with this upgraded engine that we have, we're going to be able to get to them absolutely no problem at all. Okay, looks like we're coming up on him. Looks like we have a uh, Nevada Highway Patrol officer on scene right now. Shots are going to be fired. Get in the fucking... He's running down the on-ramp, so I'm going to go ahead and get in the vehicle. And is there a shirtless guy? Talk about an episode of Cops right here, ladies and gentlemen. There's a shirtless guy. I got the shirtless one. Get on the fucking ground, dude. Get on the ground. Show me your hands. And I guess your nipples. Okay, we got one cooperating at this time. Does he have a leg tattoo or one sock on? I think he has one sock on. We have other units responding right now. Please don't hit the car, dude. Okay, no, he's actually here to provide assistance to me. Yet I'm David Blaining through the goddamn cement right now. Okay, 124. We have one in custody right now. I'm going to go ahead and get this guy in the back of the cruiser. Um, and then we'll be able to go ahead and assist the other officer that's still running after the suspect. Looks like we got... Uh, Nevada Highway Patrol en route to assist with that suspect that's getting away. Okay, yeah, it's going to be pulling up on scene right here. What are you doing, dude? Are you blocking the road? Yeah, he's blocking the road. Okay. All right, I got the suspect right here. I'm going to leave this one so we don't get to both of the suspects so close to each other. And I'm going to start running also. I'm going to run this way. It's amazing when you hear sirens coming up. Oh, they got him. I'm going to go lethal. Watch the cross. Get on the ground, dude. Okay, so two in custody right now. Scene is code four at this time. 2-10-15. Thankfully, no one was hurt in that. That could have been uh, really bad. Okay, 124, 2-10-15, code four. Um, we're going to go ahead and get out of here because it's just going to make it really chaotic on this freeway, and i got to get a suspect prisoner transported. So 124, prisoner transport, U.S. Route 13. Let's go ahead and get this one. Oh, look at the door alarm is going. That's awesome. Get out with the door open type of shit. Okay, LVMPD is here to pick up the suspect. That vehicle looks amazing at this time. The lights on it. Let's just go ahead and look at this guy's uh, light setup he has. That's amazing how it goes, like, stays red and blue, but then goes and alternates white back and forth. That's pretty awesome. Okay, so, two have been uh, taken away in custody. I'm going to be code 428, 124, code 4108, heading back to jurisdiction. Sandy Shore units, citizens report narcotics activity in Sandy Shores. 
We're now heading out to a suspected meth lab. Um, since we're an undercover unit, we're gonna go ahead and try to... Oh, shit on my face. No, because we're... That's not what I wanted to say. Just because I'm an undercover unit doesn't mean we're shitting on my face. But we're gonna go ahead and roll through the suspected meth lab area. Uh, kind of get a census on what's going on. We have kind of an upper hand having this type of vehicle. I mean, you could till, still totally tell it's a cop car. I'm just gonna go ahead and black out my lights. Officer, our RB broke down. Can you help us get it started? Looks like they need some assistance, actually. So I'm gonna go ahead and just pull over right here. See what's going on. See if we can help them out and kind of get an idea of what's going on inside that actual uh, RV. See what's going on. I don't know if she's really relevant to what's going on right now, but I'm going to go ahead and take a look inside and see if it is a meth lab. How am I supposed to help him, T? There you go. All sort of dispatch. Suspect a meth lab. God damn it. Are you kidding me? I'm going to help you out, but you're going to run me over. Sit your car still. No. Ah, you did it again. You stupid motherfucker. Okay. This one... These people are racing right here. Get! Oh, 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 dude, they just collided right there on uh, Algonquin Boulevard. Oh my god! What is going on? Hold on. Oh, dude! Where did my cop car go? Who the fuck is driving my cop car right now? I got in and pushed me out, and all of a sudden, the cop car took off, and I hear the siren in the background are you kidding me right now what is this dude oh man i gotta go through this thing i'm sorry that wasn't my fault i have no idea what the fuck just happened with that let's go ahead and quickly do this then i can get around and see if i can locate those two suspects i can't believe i had to switch my car where the fuck is my cop car uh 124 we got suspects racing throughout uh i just heard them i just heard a collision sandy shores right now let me see if i can try to locate these guys uh, get out of the way, dude. I have no idea where they went, but my cops... I don't know where my cop car went also. Dude, that's crazy. I have no idea what to say about that, but as of right now, I'm going to go ahead and look and see if I can locate my cop car. And if I find those two racers, we'll definitely go ahead and pull them over as well, too. I was literally sitting oh, here on my phone doing a text in the between on this episode just so I could send it out really quick and this dude comes smashing past me. It's the two guys uh, that were basically um, racing around town when I got my police car stolen by Casper. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and try to get these guys stopped. This one on the back is reckless as shit. I'm going to go for the one that's actually in the lead right now. And uh, I'm going to attempt to make a pullover. Pull the fucking car. I'm going to go ahead and put one at gunpoint. Get out of the fucking car. Hands up, hands up, hands up, hands up, hands up. Ah, uh, didn't work. Shit. Going after him. I need units. I need units. Let's go ahead. We got units coming out right now. Oh, he tripped. Get on the fucking ground, dude. Get on the ground right now. I'm going to wait for other units before I move in for an arrest. I got one guy still at large. But I got officers running after him right now. Oh, that was amazing. Oh, dude, look at that. Oh, and a Tahoe. That's the most badass Code 5 I've ever had. This has been a tremendously great episode from start to, well, hopefully to finish. We haven't got there yet. Let's go ahead and get this guy in the back. We still got one at large, so units are going to start running after that suspect. Get in the car. Hurry up and, and get in the fucking car, dude. I am way too far out from uh, my camera, or my guy. All right, we're going to get in route to the secondary suspect that's uh, at large right now. We got units running throughout the street, so I got to be a little careful. I'm going to hit the most outer road, Marina Drive. Okay, we're going to be on the road that the suspect's on. We'll be able to get him. We have a car that's as fast as the police now. You always wonder how they have that speed boost that we never get. Now we have that speed boost that uh, that they, they always have. It's fucking amazing. I'm so glad I figured that out. All right, we got to tap this guy. Jesus. Get on the fucking ground, dude, right now. Do it now. Police! Stop. Stop whatever Stop. the hell you're doing. Get on the ground. All right, one in, uh, we got one cooperating at this time, 124. We're going to be placing one in custody. Both of the racers will have in custody. That's actually pretty good. Usually it's hard to apprehend. I don't know where the fuck those two cops came from. Um, let's go ahead and get transport ready for Leon and Dylan. So we're going to hit seven. And then, uh, prisoner transport will come for both of these guys. And, uh, we'll get them out of our hair and we can resume patrol. That was pretty good, though. Usually we can't get both, but, uh, we were able to actually do so. All right, prisoner transports here to pick them Go both up. So we'll be code four ten eight available for calls. Dispatch, 
dispatch calling unit 6, Lincoln 24. We have a stolen police vehicle in Sandy Shores. Acknowledged. On our way. Right now we got uh, armed suspects that are shooting at cops and we're just on a traffic stop. I'm going to go ahead and attempt to get in route to these guys. Whoa, almost lost it around the corner. That's how fast we were going. That's how I like it, because this back end spins out, out now that we can actually gun it so fast. I really hope you guys, uh, if you guys play this game, you hope you try the engine multiplier, because it's definitely something that is a uh, new aspect. They even told bugs about it. Are they in the fucking ocean? I think they just went in the ocean and killed themselves. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, that is the dumbest amount of criminals. They just drove in the ocean. Good for them. So we'll be code 4. I was a little hyped up there, but uh, I guess there's no vehicle pursuit. So we'll be code 4, 10-8. Attention all units. We've got an assault in Sandy Shores. I'm going to be taking uh, this assault that just came in, actually right down the street uh, from where that pursuit was actually last terminated. Looks like it'll be coming on scene right now. Looks like it's going to be mail... Email. Why the fuck did that person just turn into that? Okay, we're going to be pulling up on scene right now. Let me go ahead and turn around. I want to keep an eye on that vehicle. I'm not sure what the hell they're doing. Alright, let's go ahead and make contact. I'm just going to see generally what's going on. I still don't know what the car is doing. They like pulled off into the fucking thing over there. Okay, how do I talk with these people? Okay, victim has bruising on her cheek. Officer, thank God you're here. The man just left before you got here. Walking down the street, he came up to me. He started saying things like, I love you, it was really creepy. I was just minding my own business, and he he just punched me. He called hey, me a bitch, I swear he's me. crazy. He said he wanted to rape me. The nice guy over here rescued me and chased him off. He's crazy, seriously. You look Shit. like a nice guy, can you help me grow up, please? Okay. So, that is uh, not really going to help us out. I'm going to go ahead and talk to the other one and see if we can get a little better information from this gentleman. Honestly, I think she's done. making the whole thing up. Okay. Uh, we've dealt with this couple before, so what we're going to do is we're going to take the female in. I'm just going to talk to the guy. He probably is going to say he has nothing to do. We've dealt with them before. Guy doesn't give her any attention, so he's a... He probably raped. That's a witness. Shit, I'm stolen the witness. Let me go ahead and just try to get this guy. Officer, you got to believe me. I didn't get do anything. Blocked. She's making it up, I swear I didn't hit her. I mean, uh, no English. What? I don't know what the fuck that means. I'm just gonna take them both in because we're getting to the point where it's LSPD. getting ridiculous having to keep don't coming back out here. Ya. So we're gonna take both out. Ah, oh, shit. This guy's gonna get pissed. It's just the wrong buttons that you have to use to, um, arrest someone, which people get mad because it's like, te technically... Oh, shit. Hold on. Damn. I don't want to get the wrong one. Excuse me. God damn it. I don't even... I don't want to go in your car. Let's try this again. Hopefully we get the right one. Okay, so male and female uh, people involved in this relationship are both going to be taken in for, um, you know, assaulting each other. Witness provided key information. Jesus, Lord. The witness provided key information to uh, help us out, and that Tahoe is flipped upside down. I'm just going to go ahead and hold it. Hopefully it'll work the... Oh, my God. Two Tahoes ready to pick these guys up. Holy shit. Okay, I'm gonna get out of here. Shit's gonna get real in a second. 124, um, oh my god. I'll be 10-8, available for calls. Looks like we got someone walking around in an area they shouldn't be back here. Looks like we actually have a lot of people in here that we shouldn't. I'm gonna go ahead and stop, uh, this gentleman right here. Stop, 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 stop. Let's see if we can get in front of him and stop this guy. No one should be walking around in these areas, so let's see if we can stop him. Make sure this guy doesn't have any warrants, like he's trying to hide out in this area. Go ahead and stop. Give me your identification. Do it right now. Okay, Lior Johnny. Go ahead and sit tight right there for me. I'm just going to go ahead and run this guy. Make sure that he doesn't have any warrants and, uh, you know, he's loitering in an area he shouldn't be. Lior Johnny. Oh, is my blinker on in this bitch? Oh, no, my code 3 lights are on. Uh, license is valid. No active warrants at this time. Date of birth is going to be 3-8-1963. So, uh, at this time, I'm just going to go ahead and issue him a warning to get out of the area because this isn't a place for him to be hanging out. All right. Go ahead and get out of here. This is a restricted area, off limits, private property. Please go ahead and get out. Okay, hopefully he'll take on out. I'm just going to go ahead and make my way down uh, this area. It looks like we actually have a lot of people that are just kind of camping out in this area. This person looks a little drunk, to be honest. Go ahead and make contact with him. 
How's it going? Police, Go ahead and stand up for me. Let me uh, get your identification. We'll go ahead and take care of the second party here in a second. Go ahead and sit tight for me, Josh. Better to just get back in the car and run it through the system. A little easier that way, Josh. Here and... Wish I could get both of the IDs and run them. That would be pretty nice. Okay, he has a valid license, no active warrant. So I'm going to go ahead and issue him a warning to get out of here because this is private property. Okay, again, get out of here. This is private property. I'm going to go ahead and get this uh, guy's identification. These are the only people I see in this area, really. So we'll just go ahead and get them searched in our system. Uh, get them written down in our trespassing list. So if they do it again, we could either take them to jail or cite them. Uh, Jacobus Mick Gimley. That is a uh, quite an interesting name this guy has. Holy shit. My blinker is on, actually. Bell license and active warrant, so he's going to be good to go to. We're just going to give him a verbal warning to get out of here. There's your license, and again, right. follow your friend okay. and get out of here and lay off the alcohol. All right, I'm just going to do a uh, search around the back end, make sure there's no one sleeping or doing anything on the back end. Dude, I said get out, and he's just going to sit there and spark a cigarette. Get out of here. I wish I could shoo him out of this area. No, get out of here. Dude. Whatever. Get out of here. There you go. Make a move. Make a move. I wish I had a flashlight. I think I do have a flashlight, actually. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Suspect, uh, or subject, is making his way off the premises. And these guys, too, back here. Go. Get out of here. I'm not even going to run your ID. Just go. Get out of here. Oh, shit. I just fucking tore that guy down. Whatever. I think I almost killed him or something. Get out. God damn, there's a shit ton of guys. I think I, I killed this guy. Holy shit, I'm gonna get the fuck out of here now. Alright, 124, we uh, cleared the premises uh, near Algonquin Boulevard at the ho hotel. I'm gonna be code 4 tonight. Attention all units, we've got a DUI in Sandy Shores. Right now we have a DUI uh, that we have to go respond to. My fucking blinker is on, which is just not legit. How do I turn it off? There we go. Okay, so right now we're going to be trying to get in contact with the DUI that's taking place right now. I think this is going to be the suspect. Just took, took a left right there. Took a right, actually. They just pulled over for no reason on the right side of the road. And they're going about 15 miles per hour. So we're going to go ahead and try to make a stop on this vehicle. What the fuck? Oh, going through people's yards. Stop. Stop the car. Stop the car. Stop the car, dude. Okay, now making a right-hand turn. And then it's going to stop right on the fucking corner. Of course they are. Make your make the turn and park in the dirt. Park in the dirt. Park in the dirt. There we go. Go ahead and get them stopped. And then we'll make a uh, traffic stop on this jackal. See what's going on. And see if these people are just extremely impaired. Or shouldn't have their license. Either one. Probably shouldn't have their license either way. Okay. 124 taking off from us. Move. Stay out of the way, dude. Okay. Uh, 124. We're on westbound Marina Drive. Uh, relatively slow rates of speed, medium traffic. Not too bad right now, so we're going to stick with this guy. He is heavily intoxicated, though, so we kind of got to watch this. As soon as he starts getting near people or some of these bikers, we might have to uh, step in and try to terminate this pursuit. Watch out, people. Stay out of the way. Stay out of the way. We won't be able to lose him with this upgraded engine, and I'm not going to stop talking about it because I absolutely love it. It's so nice to be able to hit the gas and have this thing take off like it should. Sometimes it's a little too crazy. Especially the way that these suspects drive. Holy shit. So, Westbound Marina Drive on the dirt section. Just like I'm talking about right there. Wasn't expecting him to hit the brakes like he was. But uh, now that we took damage like that, I'm going to go ahead and attempt to pit this guy. Because this guy shouldn't be driving if he is intoxicated like this. Get out of the car right now. Get out of the fucking car. I don't care who you got to call. Get out of the fucking car. Get, don't, don't run. He's running. Ah, oh, you motherfucker. You're lucky it was recharging. Get on the ground. He did that so slow, it wasn't even funny. Alright, 124. We have one in custody right now. Seen his code 4 at this time. 
Holy shit, that was a pretty wild pursuit. You weren't expecting them. I wasn't going to expect them to run in DUI, but I guess that's what a lot of DUI sub suspects do. So, 124, we are code 4, 10-8, uh, any prisoner transport to East Marina Drive. And uh, that's going to wrap it up for this one, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the undercover. If any of the cars that you've seen in the video, like uh, this LVMPD, this updated one, I think this is a 2015 or whatnot, no, 2014. You, any of those cars piqued your interest, let me know, and I will definitely get in there and do a patrol on them. Um, if I made you guys laugh or you guys enjoyed this video at all at any time, please make sure you hit that like button. And until then, we will see you next episode.